Now I know what you're thinking. You probably saw the thumbnail of this video and thought, how did it get like $140 worth of merchandise and collectibles for free? How? Well, stay tuned to this channel and I'll show you how. Let's do it. Some men aren't looking for anything logical, like money. They can't be bought, bullied, reasoned, or negotiated with. Some men just want to watch the world burn. And some men just want more video games and collectibles. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back. It's the Jokester. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, hit that notification bell, hit that subscribe button so that you can stay updated with all my content. I'm thinking about actually doing a channel revamp, doing a little rebranding in the future, so look out for that. But today, you're here to find out how did I get $130 to $140 worth of merchandise for free? Well, it came from Barnes & Noble, so I'm going to open it up. We're going to check out everything so you can see what I have, and then I'm going to tell you exactly how. So the first item is a figure, and everything I got came in a box. Uh, I thought everything was going to be shipped in one shipment, but it actually came in two. So the first thing we got is Frieza, SH Figure Arts. This figure looks absolutely awesome. The details on it is just amazing. Next up, we have another figure, and that is my boy Krillin. He's chilling, and he's getting it on with Android 18. He has the Destructo disc, which is so cool. Destructo disc! So cool! <laughs> I love Krillin. Next up, we have more Dragon Ball, and that is Dragon Ball. The time I got reincarnated is Yamcha. I had to get it. I'm really interested in reading this, trying out. It's been a while since I had some new manga, so that's pretty cool. And then last uh, but not least, very, very, very important that I get, The Last Ronin. I have been hearing that this is just one of the best TMNT comics in a long, long time. Love the glossy finish on that. It's on the back too. Absolutely gorgeous. Hard book. Full color. Don't want to give any spoils. Just a little peek inside. I'm going to tell you how I got it for free. I'm going to go step by step through it so you can see how I got all of this stuff for free without paying a single dime out of my own pocket. Let's hop to it. So my medical insurance has this cool program called Go365, where if you do certain things, you get rewarded gift cards. I have a Fitbit tied to my account, so it tracks my step. I, if I do eight days in a row, walking a minimum of 500 steps, I get $5. I can do that two times in a month for a total of $10. But there's other things you can do, like social activities, Spending time with friends and in the community, going to the doctor, getting a flu shot. You can see I got $30 from doing doctor appointments and other things like that. And I've been banking this to get $160. Now you can get physical cards and e-gift cards. So I chose e-gift cards because they come emailed to you in a day. I chose $160 of Barnes & Noble e-gift cards because they have action figures, manga, comics, and other kinds of collectibles. And I thought, why the heck not? I can get all this stuff for free instead of paying for it. A lot of this stuff I already wanted. They also had a promo code for 10% off using Summer 10. So comboing that with the gift cards and the code, I was able to get everything that I purchased in this video for absolutely free. I paid no shipping because free shipping if you spend over 50, it was just crazy. And I still have about $35, $40 left because one of the figures I wanted, the Gundam, wasn't in stock. So that's how I got all this stuff for free. <laughs> Absolutely amazing and mind-blowing, guys and girls. And remember, it's August. So counting this month and the remaining months of the year, that's five more months to earn a minimum of $10 just for taking 500 steps. 
You do that going to the kitchen, taking a poop, taking your trash out, hey, doing absolutely nothing, and you can do that. And that means with the gift credit I still have left that I got refunded because of the Gundam that wasn't in, I'm gonna have a total of about around 80 to 90 dollars that I can then use in December to get more stuff at Barnes and Noble. Maybe another action figure I didn't get because they still have Captain Ginyu, they have Tao Pai Pai, they have other mangas and comics that I would like to get. They even have Legos and Funko Pops on there. It's crazy. Now, my insurance used to have Amazon gift cards as an option, but they got rid of that. And the only thing they had on there besides Barnes & Noble was like Subway, Starbucks, IHOP. We have a Subway, but I don't really, you know, Subway's just okay. I don't want to use that all on food because I'm fat enough as it is. Yeah, I need to lose some freaking weight. My mom says it all the damn time. So I wanted to use it on getting merchandise and collectibles. So that way I don't have to pay for that because it costs a lot of money. Figures aren't really cheap. So it's really nice that I found a way every year, as long as my insurance keeps this program going, I can get 120 bucks for free to use at Barnes & Noble to get my comics, my collectibles, and other knickknacks that I want. That's it for this video. Leave your likes, comments, subscribes, all that good stuff down below. And I will see y'all in the next episode. Bye. Woo! And happy gaming and collecting. I'm the jokester, Mr. J. <laughs>